Okay guys, so I'm gonna be doing a uh, sort of a full retail review for you. Uh, they didn't have any mega boxes, I didn't see any at least uh, where I went and found this. Uh, but I do have the uh, hanger pack they have, or box, the blaster box, and the fat pack, or value pack, whatever you want to call it. Um, I believe this was like $12, this was $22, and I think this was $16. Um, so let's go in order from uh, least expensive to most expensive. Start with the value pack. These come with your, uh, your pink refractors. Come with three regular packs as well. Um, if you want to see the odds for this, you can uh, pause that and look at it. Let's get started. So, uh, start with the regular packs. Pack number one. Of course, you're looking for your top rookies from uh, 2020 in here. There's Dylan Cease looking for his teammate Robert uh, Seeger. McNeil, there's a refractor. So pack number two. Oh, there's a good one on the back. So, oh, these are sticking together. And we got a freshman flash of Jordan Alvarez. That's a cool looking card. Do like the way these look this year. So we'll put him right there. So our last regular pack of the uh, value pack. Oh. Well, there's another good one on the back. Or he's off to a hot start at least. Uh, don't know how much his value will carry over as the season goes on. But if he keeps it up, there's an 85 Kyle Lewis. So that's pretty nice. Pretty good first two packs. No base rookies, but we did get some uh, inserts of two pretty good ones. And here are your pink parallels. If you can get a good rookie out of here, then you're doing pretty good. There's a white sock, but it's not the one we're looking for. Max Muncy. <laughs> well, also, not the Dodger we're looking for. Oh, there's a Dodger rookie, but also... Looking for Gavin Wilkes. Didn't find him in there. So, uh, on to the uh, hanger box. Um, if you want to look at the odds, you can see right there. Just looking for the rookie autograph to see what your chances are. Um, try not to take too long. Do not see it right now. Uh... Yeah, I don't make you wait too much longer. You can, if you can find it yourself, uh, you can. I do know in the blaster box, it's like 1 in 59 packs. In the value box, it is like uh, 1 in uh, 60. So it's like just one off. I'm not sure about this one. I'm sure it was on the back somewhere, but I couldn't find it. And here are your packs. So you get, uh, was it 5? regular packs and you get a um, gallery preview um, since it's not like a refractor or anything I'll just go ahead and start with these you do get some coupons as well for a top gallery monster and value box so there's a Cody Bellinger Mike Trout Cunha it's a pretty cool one Tatis and Judge so uh, the preview packs I'm assuming they have like your big stars not sure if there's any rookies you can get out of the preview ones. Um, I do notice, I don't know like where you get what from. I know Top Scout is obviously like a Walmart exclusive. I did see somewhere where you can get updates for your preview pack and you can get, uh, I want to say I saw somewhere Top's Fire. Um, I would assume you get those from Target, but uh, not sure. There's a one Soto. So that's pack number two. Oh, there's a cool one on the back. I think it's a refractor too. I'm really hoping it is. That is nice. Bo Bichette refractor, right? Yes, a refractor Bo Bichette. That is really nice. Let's take Yordan down for now. 
So I actually only bought one of the hanger boxes because they didn't come with any like exclusive parallels. So I wasn't that big of a fan of them, but uh, treat me well with the the bow refractor. That's a really nice one. Mookie Betts. And we got Future Stars. I like the way the Future Stars looks as well um, this year. Wasn't really a big fan of the uh, 2020 series design in general, but. Uh, I always love Chrome. See, I'm not a big fan of all these sideways cars they have in here, but the up and down ones, I guess it's all right. Um, for those, that refractor definitely looks nice. So this is our last pack of the uh, the hanger box. We got a Jack Flaherty uh, refractor. So on to our last box of the break we got a uh, a blaster box so I get the plastic off I will show you the odds if you want to look at them oh. I'm struggling to get that one open there we go so there are your odds Got your exclusive uh, sepia refractors. Um, save those for last. Man, it looks like uh, this box got all jumbled up at the top. Hopefully, that did not mess up any of the cards. Yeah. Don't want to open at the top either, all the way. There we go. Chrome is a better stock than like series one and two obviously so it doesn't look like anything's damaged but it was sort of bent up there at the top for some reason there's a die cut on a swagger pack number two. Oh, there's a good one i think it's a refractor too normally the back card i think is a refractor i don't know oh no it's not I, i've seen it I think for some reason the we'll go into the pack first. There's a Tatis Future Stars, Gavin Lux base. Um, so I think from opening this, it seems like in the value packs, the refractor is the very last card. In the blasters, the refractor is normally the third card. Um, but still, a nice rookie. Would've been awesome having a refractor. But check what you can get. Charlie Blackman. See, Refractor is the third card for some reason. The Blasters, which is, I think it normally is, but in the ha uh, value packs and that hanger box we had, it was the last card was the Refractor if you had one. So it's a little interesting that they switched it up like that. Or it might have been like that last year. I'm not sure. But. Let's see what we got Jose Altuve, Trevor Story, AJ Puck. Uh, 85 is pretty nice one. Okay, so we have three of our regular packs left in our CPA refractors. There's a Whit Merrifield uh, refractor and a Pete Alonzo gold cup. Mookie Betts, Arenado, oh man, we got another Bo Bichette in a uh, refractor, or this is a prism, they shouldn't say refractor on the back, I believe these are called prisms, wow, that is nice, we are stacking up on the Bo refractors, that is awesome. So our last regular pack. See what we got. Still haven't got a Robert yet. Maybe we can find them in here. There's a Mike Trout. So, no Robert in the base cards for this opening. 
We do have our CP refractors. Let's see who we can get out of here. There is Robert's teammate. Maybe he'll be in here too. And nope. Dylan Sisto. That was a pretty good break. Uh do a quick recap of the better rookies we got. So we got a Gavin Lux uh base card. AJ Puck 85. Kyle Lewis 85. And a freshman flash of Jordan Alvarez. And got some pretty good rookie refractors going on here. We got a uh just a regular refractor, Boba Shet. It's not numbered or anything, but it's an awesome looking card. And we also, we just caught a prism of Boba Shet. So no base of Boba Shet, but some awesome looking refractors. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be it for the video today, guys. Uh, thanks for watching.